Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of our Super Mario Galaxy Let's Play. Last episode we managed to finish off the Terrace Dome and start onto the Fountain, I believe it was called, as well as doing that extra little Hungry Luma Star that showed up at the end of a couple episodes ago. Um, very exciting stuff, very exciting stuff. We're going to continue uh, without much hesitation, head on over to the Fountain. We've got quite a few new galaxies to check out over here. we got to finish off Space Junk, which we started last episode. And uh, who knows what else, we've got quite a bit to do, so... Let's head on in. We are still also looking to build up our uh, star bit count. Um, it is definitely a little low. Our previous Hungry Luma costed 200, or no, it was like 400 actually star bits. So us having 273 right now, not a good sign. Next time the Hungry Luma shows up, it probably will cost around, my guess is 600 to 800. And we don't have that. Um, so any place where we can kind of, I don't want to say farm star bits, but where we can get a good decent amount is probably a good place to be right now. Um, hopefully that's Camella's airship. That's a be nice. Be nice to get a few starbits here. Um, any while we're launching in, not that I see. I see those down there though. I assume there's probably gonna be some down here too. I was mistaken. <laughs> oh, okay. there's a quite a few over there. We'll make sure to grab. Never mind. <laughs> I guess we're going this way. Hey there, Goomba. I see ya. We'll make sure to take out the Goombas with a spin. So we increase our starbit amount. We go a nice hearty couple star bits from each of them anything up here i feel like they'd put like a one up no nothing okay there's a one up over there i guess but okay, well let's hit you hit you i was about to say pretty clear what that's gonna do so do you see this nice okay that's what i wanted to see barrel We can pretty easily. Yeah, I was about to say. Not much of a challenge. I guess we're still kinda technically meant to be early on at this level. Let's break that. Backflip. Perfect. Okay. Hey there, buddy. That's fine for now. Grab all those. Get a backflip. Very nice. We are doing great at that little star bit mission I was talking about. <laughs> um Okay. Perfect, perfect. Thank you as well. I do see that. Uh, Magic Koopa, I believe they're called up there. So let's be very cautious of that. Hit that. Nice. Okay. I don't want to waste this on you. I'm going to use that and then spin for you. Perfect, okay. Get out of here. Uh, I was going to say, I swear there were star bits when these little big guys were there, and there was. Take you down. Perfect. Order. Oh? I don't think we did this before. This feels... Yeah, okay. I don't remember doing this. This is a nice little secret. Okay, okay. I'll take all that. A hundred star bits on this one level alone. Hey there. We'll take those good. No, not what I meant to do at all. Sort of like auto locked onto that. That was weird. Um, I'm gonna get hit by that. You. And unfortunately for you, you are in the way. You also spin. Take you. Oh nope. I'm hoping this will get probably just give me a one up, right? Oh, a homing shell, okay. I don't think we can take this with us, but we'll try, right? Yeah, no. Okay, that's alright. I This looks like a boss fight platform, I'll say that. And it looks as though I am correct. Hello there. Okay, we see our star. <laughs> uh, I don't really want coins. I'll leave that just in case we need a bit of extra health. Oh, right. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember how this fight works. Okay, one. Um, looks like there's just coins everywhere. Oh, nope. We just got to hit her and then she'll make star bits. Okay. Come on. Hit me with another green. That looks good. And two. Probably one more. Uh, 
right, let's harvest all those for sure. These guys just drop coins with them, I think. We can just ignore them if we're quick with it, though. There we are. And that should be a star. I wonder if the other Magic Koopa is still going to be there. Not that it really matters much. We could just grab the star. Doesn't look like it. So, star it is. 137 star at another level. That's that's a good value. <laughs> we, I was just talking about how we needed more of those, and then we get a whole lot of them from one level. I love that. Touch them back down. Perfect. There we go. It's interesting that we're back in front of Rosalina right now. Why is that? Normally it puts us back in the dome. We unlocking comets? We are unlocking comets. It seems that a prankster comet has appeared somewhere. Prankster comets have very strange effects on galaxies. If you want to learn more about the, those curious comets, ask Loom who knows about such things. I already do know about those comets, so we are going to head on over and go back to the terrace to see what we can do about taking that down. Right in here. Uh, no. The red ones? What were, The red ones are... Speedy Comet. Okay. Oh, okay. I do remember. I do this. I remember doing the Speedy Comet to take down the Dino Prana. It's weird. I feel. I feel nostalgic for a level that we did like, however many episodes ago. Dino Prana. Let's do this. Fly right off. Here we go. Okay. See that big egg? The iconic Dino Prana egg. Can't really stick around and grab too many starbits here. We can grab any that we immediately see. We gotta remember, it's this way for Dino Piranha. We need to be on the other side of the planet. Perfect. Nice and easy. Can I grab some? I grabbed one, that's fine. There we go. Okay, okay. Well, we've got plenty. I've like four minutes to beat this. This isn't bad at all. Two. Uh oh. Three. I'm surprised I made it out of there. Uh oh. Yeah, not making it out of that one. I forget how much this mud really does slow me down. Four and five. Perfect. Where's that launch star going to be? Very nice right next to us. Come on. There we go. Now here, I remember we just need to beat you. Oh, what? We'll stomp on you to hopefully get a coin out of it. Or not. Okay, where? Uh... Okay, yes. Okay, I guess we can just jump on him. Normal I remember last time we used the little I don't know, the little balloons. I guess, you know. One of the only Mario games where it feels like you can actually jump on a prana plant. Kinda interesting. Let's get past everyone. Just in case for whatever reason the Dino Prana fight takes us a while. I don't think it will. We fought him plenty of times at this point. There we go. And bam. There's that big old iconic tail. It looks kind of like a seed of some sort. Like a walnut or something. Hey there, big guy. Been a, been a while, and by a while I mean like three episodes, I think. Three, that's about right, I think. Okay, very nice. Let's grab some bits, please. Is that it? Nope. And this will be that. That was real fast. <laughs> Got lots of starboard spots on. Hopefully, we'll be able to grab a few of those. I'm not going to, like, really focus on it too much here. Because um, even though it looks a lot, like, a lot, there's not, I don't think, really that many. Um, we'll grab, like, what we can immediately see, but then just get down down here. 62 star bits is pretty good for a speedrun level, I think, too. There we go. We did get a star. Thank you. Touching back down, and... Very nice. Up to 14. Making very good progress. And will there be another comet 
We'll check real fast. Is there? No. Not that I see, at least. So let's just head back to the dome that is the fountain, I believe it was called. Here we are. Spin. I didn't need to spin that time. Maybe it's just like my hitbox was in, not in the right place last time. I'm wondering where the Hungry Luma that's going to show up for this dome is. Because there's one for every dome. We haven't seen one here yet. We do. We have a comet here. Let's do it. Speedy comet. For um, the pull stars? Or... I wonder. I guess we'll find out, huh? There we go. And... Pull star. Yeah, okay. We were kind of speedrunning it last time anyway, so this shouldn't be too bad at all. There we go. Got a little yawn there. Um, okay, this shouldn't be too bad at all. We've done it once before. I kind of speed ran it last time we were at this level. Perfect. The trick is to just only hold on to the pull stars for as long as you like need to really attach, and it pulls your momentum. I think I figured it out. Okay, this is probably where we'll lose a little bit of time. Unless I'm incredible at it, which... There we go. Bad day to be a hater, huh? Um, let's get out of here. Yes. Uh, okay. Starve it, starve it, starve it. Ah. I, you know, I started this series, and I wonder if it's noticeable. Um, I started this series using Joy-Cons. Um, two separate Joy-Cons. I think they probably disconnected once or twice, so you probably were able to see that. Uh, come on, come on. Pull the, pan the camera up. Thank you. Um, but I switched over at some point, like maybe about two-thirds of the way into the series, to using my Pro Controller. Um, I originally was using the Joy-Cons because it was like, you know, they're more Wiimote-shaped, and that's how this game is intended to be played. That way you could also, like, use the pointer and shake it or whatever. Um, come on, come on. Uh, to... Where is it? Come on! Dude. To, uh... Like, easier without having to move your whole controller. But I'm gonna be honest, I think the, the Pro Controller is just so... It feels so good in my hands that it's like, I don't even care. Like, it's whatever. Um, let's go under you. We do gotta free all the toads. Probably get done that a little faster. There we go. Um, so yeah, I use a work controller now. Uh, moving the controller to like use my cursor really isn't that bad. Um, I think partially it's because I I played a lot of a uh, played a lot of Splatoon, and the best way, the most like competitive way, I should say, to play Splatoon and have like a competitive edge is to use the motion control aiming. So I think I'm just kind of used to being able to move my controller around. Uh, and it doesn't really like throw me off at all. I don't know, I'm curious to see uh, what you guys think about that. Is it is it like a pain for you guys to, like if you had to move around like this? I was just blew it there. Um, would it negatively impact your ability to like control Luigi or Mario, I guess? I'm very curious to hear your guys input on that four now already nice okay here we go though let's not just jump into the void on this one and perfect right back to the beginning who would have guessed uh turn back around that was a little bit close and i think it's just a straight shot right yeah and perfect a little over a minute to spare that wasn't bad at all good job luigi yeah, personally, I don't think it really affects me that much. Um, but I, I, am, I am curious to see, have you guys been able... If I didn't say anything or if things didn't pop up on the screen at all, um, I'm curious if you guys would have noticed. I think that's a better um, way to gauge that, right? If it's affected my play, is if people watching have noticed. And anyway, base spotted, protecting massive energy spikes. What are they doing here? Save. Then we'll head back to Space Junk. There's at least one more star we can do there. fly that should have enough time to at least get this start on so and it is Terran. uh 
I think I do remember this one. I don't think I liked it either. <clears throat> yeah, this is the one where you gotta like grab and pull, right? If I'm remembering correctly. Got some bits. Hey there, Captain Toad. I need to get a speedrun mode. <laughs> I just realized I was going as fast as I could. I don't need to. Um, I can afford to stop and spin at those guys. Grab some star bits. You know what? There's quite a few star bits here. Let's grab them all. Here we go. This way. We'll speed run through this, but not because it's difficult, just because I don't like it. <laughs> Sling there. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Hungry Luma. Ooh, let's do that. Do we have... Oh, no. How many do we need? How many? How many? Okay, we're not at 50. We're at 36. Can we get 14 more? That feels necessary, too, doesn't it? To move on? Am I crazy? Hey, buddy. Wrong place. Uh, maybe not, because that's a way out. Come on, how many are up to? No way are we going to be one short. No, there's sparkles over here. Nice. Okay. Let's not miss any when we shoot at the Luma, then. Yeah, I can back for that, maybe. Yeah. Way easier. Okay, where's that hungry Luma? Uh... There we go. Hey, buddy. We are back with your bits. Please do not miss any. Don't let any drop. We only have 50. There we go. Perfect. That's it. I'm stuffed. Here we go. Transform. It, it like sounds painful. It, I think I've mentioned it before. They scream. Yoshi head. Let's do it. Lots of Goombas here. I kind of remember this. Oh, I'm not getting any Starbits by taking them out. Interesting. I feel like if I did this, would be a great way to get star bits, so... For balance reasons, I kind of get it. Each of them drops, what, three star bits? And I've taken... How many... You think there's 15, maybe, here? I feel like 15's a pretty... It's probably low, but a safe estimate, so... Okay, is it just you? Nope. Not quite. I see your friends. That feels like it. Yeah, very nice. Thank you, giant uh, floating Yoshi head in space. We will definitely grab that. And I think that was a secret one. I don't think that was the main objective star. But we got it. That's very nice. Perfect. And touch back down. It's what I love to see. Yoshi's the unexpected experience. E not experience. Appearance. We will save our game, yes. This episode is starting to get a little bit long, so I do think I'm going to call this one here. Thank you guys so much for watching this episode. Make sure to tune next time. We'll head back to Space Junk and do that. I think it was Space Junk we were just in, right? Yeah, because we didn't do Terran Toxic's Toxic Web. So next episode, we'll come back. We'll go do that. And then I think that's it for Space Junk, unless there's some other comments or something that we might do, which will probably take priority. The comments are, they seem like they're an important thing to do when they show up. So we'll make sure to do those if any show up. Otherwise, we'll do Terran Toxes. We'll go check out some other galaxies in the fountain here. Maybe we'll be able to get it done. I don't know. Um, quite a few stars in this dome so uh we'll see we'll see um but again thank you guys so much for watching this episode and have a good day